Now, what does it typically mean for us? Do property values go down? You know, if you go back, historically speaking, and look back in the 1970s, back when Carter was in office and interest rates went through the roof, I remind you, some of you may not know this, but interest rates were as high as 18%. I don't know if it got higher than that, but 18% for a first time mortgage. My brother in Colorado, I remember back in the 80s, paid 18% for his first mortgage. Can you imagine that today? It sounds scary, but people did. And people thought that property values would drop back then, but they didn't. They didn't. What happens is those interest rates eventually will slow down and come back to more of a normal rate. It's been extremely low, which has been great for real estate investing long term. But as of right now, they are going up. So what should you do to prepare yourself? Well, I would definitely try to get your hands on as many long term rentals as you can before the rates go even higher. So because as you buy those rental properties, you won't be able to make as much cash flow because, again, your monthly payment is going to be more. So keep an eye on that. <laughs>